guys, my name is Libby and I'm six months pregnant and I'm going to go through my baby haul with you. I'm expecting a baby girl in September. So um, I'm going to do a little bit of postpartum um, haul and also some baby stuff. Okay, so I'll start with the Clever Mama bath clever bath it's fold uh, it folds out and into your sink so i just thought that was so handy and it's so portable and this was 44.99 from clever mama i will link everything down below and so that's the first bath the second one that i got that we will use wherever we have a bath if we have one in my mother's but we don't really have one in where we're living so I'll probably end up using the sink one, but it's portable as well. But this one is the Angel Care Bath Support. And I got it in pink, but I, I've got so much pink now. I'm all, almost sick of pink. So I find some other um, some other colours. But the Angel Care costs £20.49 on Amazon. And I'll link it down below. Now, on to baby carriers. I got two baby carriers. I got one for my husband and one for myself. Um, my husband's one is um, obviously just a little bit more masculine. It's in a plain grey. I bought this for twenty eight eighty eight on Amazon. So it's like it's just a cheap carrier. You don't need an expensive carrier, but I did get my one. My one was a bit more designer. So my carrier has not arrived yet because it's come from the States. And it's the Kalugo and it's in a leopard skin and it's just really funky. And I just can, can't wait to use it. And uh, But it was too feminine for my husband. So my leopard skin Kalugo baby carrier cost $125. And I got a friend of mine in America to order it. And she's going to post it over to me because it's not actually available in Ireland. So that's my carriers. So just a cheap one for my husband and then the designer one for the ladies. Okay. So then I bought these little bibs, these little, um, they're from babybibs.ie. Now they're a little bit expensive, but they're super cute. And I just, yeah, they're about four or five euro each. I'm not sure. I think it was like 15 quid or something for the three of them and delivery. But I will stand corrected on that. I will link the exact price down below. But they're like an Irish company again, Baby Bibs die okay then i bought these on amazon these were 13.99 i think these came from the states and when we're ordering stuff at the moment due, due to covid you don't know the quality until it arrives so these arrived this morning and i was so happy that they weren't like really cheap they're just little mittens and little girly colors and the hats and the hats are the material is fine so i was delighted with that because I'm going to probably wait till the shops reopen until I buy a lot of the clothes. But like, I think my family and friends, they will buy, like everybody be dying to go shopping and especially for a baby girl. So hopefully um, we will be all sorted. But I'm just making sure that I have the essentials as I'm six months now next week. So I just want to, be, I'm, I'm a real planner. I like to be prepared. This is probably a take home outfit. And I ordered this from... Um, craft creations wax where i think it is yeah and it was 12 euro and i'm going to get the newborn size as well but i did get the three to six months because i just loved it it's so cute it's like a little rainbow kind of reflective cut yeah it's it's just kind of chromey rainbowy colors going through the font and it says read me a story tuck me in tight tell me you love me and kiss me good night and I fell in love with this when I saw this online. And unfortunately, she had no newborn. But I'm going to get back on to her now in the next few weeks. And get the newborn one as well. Because I'd say, hopefully, I'll be able to use both. We'll see. This is not a three. So, and that was €12 Euro from Craft Creations. So, i going through all them. I bought these little booties in... Um, a little place out in Hoth in Dublin and these are just adorable they're 100% wool I practically broke into the shop to get these 
you know, they, they, they agreed to sell me a little pair. Of, they were reopening, setting up for the reopening. And they said, okay, go on, you can have, you can have the boots. And I paid them in cash because they hadn't reset up yet due to COVID. So and I got that and I was so happy. They're so cute. Like they'd be really funky now with kind of some casual beigey trousers. And yeah, I just think they're gorgeous. So that's that. Now, some sleepwear. This is the snooze pooch. Now, I bought these actually from, I think these are available in a lot of places online, but I bought them from an Irish company again. And um, unfortunately, I ordered the wrong tog. I ordered a one tog, and I'm like, that's not going to do me in the winter. So when I got back onto them and said, because it wasn't very clear on the website, I got back onto the company and I said, I have opened the packaging and I, it just turned up and it was so light. And I'd opened the packaging and he said, look, I'll give you, I think, 10 or 20% off of another order. So I ordered the same design in a higher tog. And I still have that in the packaging there. Um, let's see, I have this little bouncer and this came from the states from amazon and it was 29.99 but it's got this like horrible big warning thing like the, not to put it up on a table or whatever so i'm probably going to take that off i just i have some bouncers to hand me downs but they're all boys ones so yeah i was delighted with that now postpartum haul postpartum i ordered this support belt for after to take down some of the swelling a lot of people wear these and this one was 23.99 it was amazon's choice um i tried to get it around me this morning but like i'm i'm quite big at the moment i ordered it in the medium so i may need the large if i'm quite swollen after the baby um, but yeah, it was like, you know, 23.99. I'll see how we go. Like, I'm thinking about maybe getting the large in it. Not sure. Will, um, I think that you don't have to order a really expensive one of these. Not, I'm still researching it. I think it's a new thing people do to try and take down that swelling afterwards to help your uterus go back down. Now, these personal hygiene purifiers. I got one. A cheapy one that I had for years lying around and I said I would order the fancy one with the little hook effect so you can get it right in to get yourself nice and clean and um, not sore from toilet roll after giving birth so the hacker I bought the one with the lid so this was 29.99 and I think they're well worth having just to catch extra breast milk if you can at all. Like even when you're feeding on one, you can just pop that on the other and catch a little bit of breast milk. We'll see. We'll see how I get on. The next one is breast milk storage bags. I got 50 of them on Amazon for just over £10. I got my nipple butter, Earth Mama. I know there's other ones that are more highly rated perhaps and I may get more of that that was 29.99 though that's you know that tiny little pot so hopefully that works really well hopefully i've got these um bra extenders and i'm using one of these black these the great one the great thing about these these are only four euro 59 they have an elastic in them as well so they just give plenty of stretch i'll show you on the cream one I'm using this one in a black and it just gives you that bit of comfort these are just a must for like especially when you hit like over six months and else you're one of those amazing people that just looks like doesn't blow out and need bigger bras which that's definitely not me so um these breast pads i got the disposable ones i should have got the reusable ones because they're supposed to be softer when you throw them in the wash and they're just handy so i'll get some of the reusable ones as well but just when i hadn't done much research and i just grabbed these and i'm not sure they think they were like six euro 
six euro fourteen cent says there. So hopefully, um, they I'll use these and use them up and stuff. But yeah, um, okay. So that's all I'll do for the moment. Probably will have a part two, um, which I'll do all the um different types of um co sleepers. Like I, some of them have arrived. I ordered a portable one, and I ordered another one that we can just keep wherever we're living and um my attachments for the bugaboo you know the aprons the hoods all that kind of thing my buggy um and more clothes will arrive so i can go through a part two um hopefully uh so when they all arrive i'll uh put that up so if you like the video give me a thumbs up and um i'll chat to you soon